Welcome to Bruce Silverstein Gallery, where today we are looking at the works of Shinichi Moriyama, a Japanese artist from Nagano, Japan, where traditional photography depicts typically a, a single event at a moment in time. Shinichi's work, in fact, depicts a, a, se a sequence of events all occurring what seem to be simultaneously. Um, there is no sense of beginning or end in this work, only, only a, a, a connection to movement and flow and because of the, uh, the technique where he has taken 10,000 photographs and, and uh, composited them, you have this incredible depth within the figure, almost a draping sense, yet this, this is a new dancer, there is no clothing, there is nothing to drape, what you're looking at is the body form as it moves, uh, richly depicted uh, in the photograph. And what ends up happening is, uh, while we're looking at a series of movements, in the end we have this single form that has uh, such a sculptural quality and, uh, and beautiful light and uh, all, the, all the various skin tones that are mixed, mixed and blended together um, that creates something that is completely new, something that we've never seen before. Uh, this would be our third exhibition of Shinichi's works. His earliest body of work was entitled Kusho, which uh, translates to writing in the sky. And Kusho were images of water and ink colliding in midair. Unlike Kusho, which is actually a photograph taken at roughly a 10,000th of a second, depicting a single collision, the nudes are in fact 10,000 photographs taken over roughly two to four seconds. And the artist has superimposed those images uh, to create a single form. While tradition plays an important role in Shinichi's work, his interest in, in calligraphy, his interest in, in Buddhism, um, certainly the history of art is, uh, is relevant. In this work he talks about Duchamp's Nudes Descending a Staircase, which was created in 1912, roughly a hundred years ago. And in that painting, the nude is depicted um, multiple times in different stages walking down the staircase and in this work Shinichi attempted to to also accomplish capturing movement without a before a middle or an end um, all of it happening simultaneously so this is a bit of a, a nod to Duchamp